Crafting with Tim Tim. Hey there guys, it's your good buddy Tim Tim here again. And my special guest today is Emma. She's got a special new slime she wants us to try. Hi guys, it's Emma. And the slime that we are going to be trying, or I guess making, will be watery slime. So this is what your final product will look like. It's really watery and weird to play with, but super fun. Alright guys, to make watery slime, you'll need two bowls, it doesn't matter what the sizes are, a strainer, a spatula to stir with, a spoon, a measuring cup, baking soda, saline solution, guar, gum powder, water, and this part is optional. It's food coloring. You will need two cups of water. We already put one cup in, but just dump both of your cups into the bowl. Slowly start adding your gum powder into the water. Make sure you stir it thoroughly too. We added about one tablespoon of the guar gum powder. So you want to add until it kind of looks kind of soupy and chunky like this. Slowly start adding in the, your mixture into your strainer. Make sure you have a bowl under your strainer too so that it doesn't go everywhere. Make sure you get it all. Now slowly start pushing it through the strainer. And it will go through. And it will leave the chunky parts of the gum powder behind. Next, get one cup of warm water. Mix in about a half a teaspoon of baking soda until it's fully dissolved. So wait, this is what ours looked like once we took out the strainer. But now you can start slowly adding in some of your baking soda mixture. We like to add it in very slowly just to make sure we don't make it too watery. Just keep adding until you feel it's enough. Next, you can add in your food coloring. Like I said before, this part's optional. I'm going to add in one more drop to make it a little bit more vibrant. Next, you can add in your saline solution. This is the very last step. It should start looking really watery. Add a bit until it stops sticking. Ours is a bit sticky still. Alright, this is what our final product is like. It's super watery and super fun. I hope you enjoyed my video on how to make watery slime. If you're having trouble finding guar gum powder, you can find it at your local bulk barn. Well, that was a lot of fun there, guys, wasn't it? I really like that watery slime. It seems like a lot of fun to play with. So I'm going to go play with the watery slime, and you guys have a great day. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and don't forget, keep your crafts meowy. Crafting with Tim Tim is out of here.